Hi all folks, this is Max from Xenomax.com and AndroidDummies.com. So today I'm going to show you how to turn your Android smartphone or tablet into a security webcam. Um, I'm going to get into more details. For example, you're, you're going to vacation in Hawaii and you want to set up a, a security camera for your living room because um, then, and you have a extra you know tablet device that you're not gonna take to Hawaii with you then you can turn it into a IP camera um, so you have to go to the market and download this app called uh, IP webcam it's free and uh, today I'm, I'm only gonna show you how to use it locally so maybe you know your kids in the backyard but you're working in the front uh, front your home office in the front and uh, you know you can walk, have an eye on your kids without being there. Put your Android tablet or smartphone there. Anyway, open up the app, and you can set up a uh, login password. You can use front-facing camera. You can change the resolution, um, all this stuff. But I'm not going to set the password for now. And you can change the port, but it's defaults to 8080. And all you got to do, and it also there's an option, uh, so it's, it'll stay on all the time. And uh, you you might want to put um, power on your phone if you're gonna actually use it for a long time. And you just hit start server. And this is actual you know view of what you will see. And I'm just gonna place this. Um, actually, let me show you. It'll give you the actual address. I'm actually connected locally to my uh, home Wi-Fi. Now, if you want to go a step further, you can go into your router settings and um, port forward this address to your um, public IP address. And you can use uh, services like OpenDNS to set up your router so you can have an actual domain name. So you can be actually be in Hawaii and check your uh, camera at home. Um, but I'm not going to get into all that. I'm just going to show you the local part first and then next time I'll show you um, how to do the, the open DNS and also how to set up multiple. You can set up like 10 of these and put it like everywhere in your house and be like, you know, one of those people in the movies with security cameras everywhere. Anyway, um, just put this here. Uh, this is like my backyard kind of. I just set it on my monitor. And uh, that address you saw, which was 192.168.2.115 and uh, dot dot eight zero eight zero. Actually, let me show it again so you can be sure of it. The address there, um, right there, right? We're going to put it into our browser and it'll bring up our security camera. It's simple as that. So I'm going to enter the address 192.168.12. 2.115.8080 and it'll bring up Android uh, IP webcam. Um, sorry, uh, that was my um, incognito mode. I guess it doesn't work on my incognito mode. Anyway, you have this. Um, you can uh, basically. Um, there's there's a bunch of information you can use. You can actually use a IP camera software and uh, point it to whatever the address it shows here, or you can just uh, open it up. Um, let me see. Do do do. Uh, use browser bit built-in view viewer, and then voila, that's my backyard. You can see. Um, so that's just a basic basic way of setting up um, a webcam. So you know, if you have uh, if you want if you don't want to spend a whole bunch of money on you know uh, webcam cameras, those things are like outrageously expensive, and you have a bunch of old you know you can even go buy a bunch of old Android uh, phones and set it up as a webcam. It works pretty well actually, um, and I actually got um, another thing you can do is I've got this uh, uh, nightlight wireless nightlight I reviewed this before and I set it right by my you know Android webcam so if at night if somebody comes in you know, boom I got the video and also there's way to set up a um, bunch of programs on your computer to send emails I won't get into that I just want to show you this Android webcam server app which is really cool and next time I'll have a, a tutorial on how to 
actually view it on your phone, um, not just your computer. So, see y'all later. Thanks. Subscribe.